All right, thank you, Brian. Plenty of Bengals fans were up bright and early yesterday to tailgate, and a newcomer who is a familiar face in the Miami Valley got to go to his first game ever. Good game to go to as well. Super Sammy Jones received a heart transplant last year and has been cheered on by Bengals players and fans ever since. Richard Childs spoke with Super Sammy and his family for this 2 News follow-up. This is about having fun with our friends and family and just enjoying celebrating the bingos. Who day? Who day? And celebrating with the who day chicks. That's, that makes it all that. It's just amazing. Going into week seven, the orange and black faithful came out early and ready to roar. It's all about food, friends, and a whole lot of fun. The parking lot surrounding Paycor Stadium transformed into Bingle Nation bringing the energy and the excitement of one of the NFL's best fan bases. And this week, the Bengals are getting some extra support from a super fan who is now healthy enough to come off the sidelines and line up with the home team. He's been rooting for him all year and, and you know, for the Super Bowl run, and now he's, 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 okay. <laughs> and now he's healthy, and, uh, and we're here, man. It's, it's, a, it's, it's a beautiful day. During last year and in the offseason, Bengals players cheered on three-year-old Sammy Jones as he fought through a heart transplant. Today was Sammy's turn to show off the love. It's just been a true blessing, man. You know, just the whole city that's just really supported us in, in a huge way. On the field and in the stands and in the parking lots of the Houday Nation, everyone is earning their stripes, coming together as week seven to make this Sunday truly super. The city and everybody that's prayed for us through church and it's just amazing.